Okay, so today I want to talk about how I choose to remove uh, lint and hairs and things from clothing. So, obviously, if I were to sit here and clone these things out, you know, with my clone tool or my healing tool, in which case it would take, you know, a very long time to sit there and paint all that stuff out. For most portrait application, if it's not a billboard, if it's a normal sized image, especially 8x10s, 5x7s, depending upon what your client orders, um, you can certainly get away with a much faster way of getting through this. So the way I like to do that is with the dust and scratches filter. So what I'm going to do is we're going to press command J, which creates a new layer above our background. And we're just going to go to filter, noise, dust and scratches. And right away you can see it has my last settings which work pretty good here but I like to start with a small radius and mess with the threshold and the radius until I can get most of the dust and scratches gone without blurring too much of the image so obviously that seems like a pretty good setting right there we it has messed up the skin so we don't really want to use that of course in that way so we're just going to apply it and then we're going to press and hold our option key and press our mask which creates a mask over that layer and then all we have to do is grab a white brush uh, take yourself up to 100 percent opacity and paint on your image where you need to get rid of the lint and distractions on your shirt. So there you go. So simple there before and after. Looking at it closer before and after before and after. So literally a couple seconds and you can have that part cleaned up.